Hello everybody, my name is Xventure, and welcome back to Monster Hunter World Final Fantasy Edition. Now, I know it has been quite a long time since I actually played Monster Hunter World, ever since I defeated Xenojiva. And since all of you, well, not probably all of you, some of you are wondering why did I say Final Fantasy Edition? edition. Well, if most of you have already know, Final Fantasy somehow crashed into the Monster Hunter world. And now, we're going to start our journey from here. Um, just letting you know, I did... I already did some parts of this. Well, as you can see, I'm still in the f beginning because I had trouble with the dang bird that played the po Chocobo song. And to be truthfully honest, that actually kind of works. Because the first monster that you have to fight up against for this special edition, you it feels like that giant bird monster really is a chocobo. And all of you, I'm pretty sure a whole lot of you know that I actually really love Final Fantasy. It is a really epic game and you can't really deny it. Alright. I already tried doing this once, and it became a complete fell fail. I was clo I was close to beating it, but uh, but this time I'm ready because I got myself the the sword of the Sky Queen herself, Rathian, so that way I can actually poison the bird. So that way, if that crystal does heal it. That bird's gonna have a little bit of trouble. Plus, I'm gonna need uh, some noise nuts. Or whatever those things are called. See, it's been a while for me that I played it. But hey, I've been doing a little bit of work myself. Okay. I'm ready. I'm gonna give I'm gonna give a bird a good old serving of kick ass. And I gotta be careful of the other monsters too, because the Kulu Yaku is already a, a problem itself with the diamond. I mean, not diamond, crystal. I gotta stop saying that. Now, we just have to find that damn bird. Okay. If I was the Kulu Yaku, where would I, get, where would I be? Just gotta try out a whole bunch of places until I find him. Where are you, you Kulu Yaku? Hello, Cactar. Oh yeah, the cutscene. If some of you don't know. Yeah, you'll be following... In the beginning of the game, you'll have to follow Cactars that lead you to this... To that uphill over there that'll start up a cutscene where you see a Moogle and a... Uh... Diamond... No, Crystal. Gosh dang it. And then the Kulu Yaku takes it and then becomes bigger. Give it a diamond, Kulu Yaku! You burnt brain of a bastard! And do be careful of Kulu Yaku because not only did it get bigger, but it has also become stronger. Hey, I got a Nova Crystal. Thank you, Kulu Yaku. Now please go fuck yourself. Now, all of you are kind of wondering, why am I being such a savage on this bird? Because I lost to it. Somehow, this low-level bird was able to kill me and make me fail the mission. I'm not accepting that. I'm not accepting this Chocobo of a ripoff to beat me. So, you know what? I'm going to break every part of its skull. And just hope to God... That it doesn't grow bigger! Oh boy, it's getting the glows in its eye. Unless it's poisoned. It is poisoned! That's actually pretty good. Over here. here, pretty pretty! I don't think you can capture it. Can you capture it? Leave a comment below if you can actually capture Kulu Yaku while he has the diamond. Because that would be actually good to know. Because if I can capture it, then that means I could actually finish the mission more faster. With the addition with the, you know, the poison sword. 
Stand still. No! Get back over here! Go to Yaku! Get over here! Ah! Stupid chocobo ripoff! Get over here, Kulu Yaku! Get over here! Man, I wish that cact I wish that little cactar was here, so that way I can make it shoot needles at this stupid bird. Ah, you can't hurt Demon Blood. Not while he's playing music. Get over here. Oh. Ah, crap. Yeah. Except the poison, Kulu. Crystal! Diamond! I know I'm getting it wrong. I feel like I am. Like, my god, I... I don't know which one it is. No! Stop beating me up with a damn... Ugh. Screw you! Ah! Stupid bird brain! Ugh. Wish I could hop on your back so that way you could drop... No, 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 no! No! It got bigger! Oh no, and there's the Barath. It's poison, that's good. Please stay poisoned for a little bit longer. For about like, I don't know, a couple of minutes. Please don't attack me. Please don't attack me. Oh hey, my sharpening is done. That's actually pretty good. <laughs> Screw you, Kulu Yaku. Yeah, put the beat down into that bird. Still kind of strange, and I'm getting points because this the Kulu Yaku is breaking parts on the Barath. Like Barath, like seriously, you gotta get rid of that mud. You're dirty. I'm taking, I'm taking your, I'm taking your mud. Ah! Why do you have to hit my me? You oh, gotta run, 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 gotta run. Gotta run, gotta run. Because I can't take down the muddy beast while I'm taking down a bird I'll grow with the diamond or crystal. I don't know which one it is. I really gotta stop messing up on my words. Yeah. Give me those nuts. And don't and don't you even dare take it the wrong way, people. I need I need the nuts to make some noise. Yeah. Are you like me now, Kuluyaku? I just broke your tail. I wish that was kind of a thing. Oh no! <laughs> no! Stop God! Ah! Stop it! This ain't fun, Kuyaku! You're playing damn dirty! Ah! You're an idiot! Ah! Kulu Yaku, I'm gonna really enjoy decapitating your head like how I broke your stupid face. Face, I mean. That's what I meant to put in. Stop charging in with the damn crystal. Diamond, I don't know. I'm just sick of you, bird. You stupid chocobo ripoff. Come on. Just please accept your death. I wish I could get on your stupid back so that way I can make this job easier. But no, you can't accept it. Get over here. No, don't charge me with your with the damn crystals. Get over here. Ugh. Stop jumping. Stop jumping, stop charging, stop doing all that, and just let me beat you up with my sword! And then let me poison you! Where do you think you're going? If you're thinking about healing, you better think again, you mother I really hate this bird. That this dang bird caused me nothing but trouble. I just tried to take it down, but 
Kudo Yaku, you better get over here, I'm gonna kill you! The Kudo Yaku, when it when it comes with the diamond, it gets big it gets big as the Ajanith. Which really pisses me off! Cause the Ajanis would think about joining in the party. No! Stand still! Ah! No, oh, I just want to cut you in half. No, stop looking at it. Please accept the poison that I'm trying to give you. Just accept it, please. Yeah. Accept the poison. Oh, hey, you accepted it. Nice. That makes the job a little bit easier. Now, can you make it even more easier and stand still? Seriously, I'm gonna I'm gonna start jabbing this sword up your ass. Just screw you, Kulu Yaku. Yeah. I just want the diamond back. You don't deserve it, because you're just a dang bird. <laughs> Ow! My ribs! Stop looking at it! Where are you going? Get the hell back over here. I'm not done with you yet, you Kulu Yaku. Get, get over here. Get over here. Oh, no. Whoop. At least he didn't use the diamond. Oh, no. Kudu Yaku getting bigger. Noise nut didn't work. Shut up. Just let me destroy your face. Get back over here. Okay, hopefully, hopefully it'll start a fight with the Barath. I hope. <sighs> okay, it's starting a fight with the Barath. That's good. Look at it. It's about the size of the Ajanith. Screw you! Ah! I just want to poison you with my poisonous blade. So that way you can die faster. You gigantic shit! Ah, no! Fuck you! They're ah, fucking barons! They're not helping! Okay, now you are! Just keep hitting him! That makes it more easier for me, please! And thank you! No, Barath, you're not being helpful again. Oh, ja Kulu Yaku, please stand still so that way I can cut you. Well, you're getting headbutted by the Bareths. So that's good. Get over here so that way I can poison you. I'm going to give you poison up the ass. You got poison. Fuck you. <laughs> screw you, uh, screw you, Kulu. No! What's this? A rolled up dung. Yes, I just took a rolled up dung. It gave me dung pods. Dung pods. <sighs> if that bird's thinking about healing, it's got another thing coming. You stupid Kulu. There you are, picking another fight with the with the Barath. 
Man, I wish I had. I wish I actually brought some bombs with me, so that way I can actually blow them up. Bonsai, I'm on the track. It's becoming a war zone now. Barris, you're kind of doing a good job. Kind of. Just keep trying to beat them up. Because I'm pretty sure you can do more damage than I can. <laughs> yeah, keep going, Barris. I didn't want to jump on him. I'm trying to kill the Yukulu Yaku. Ah, please don't attack me. Get over here, you stupid chuck chuck about rip off. Get over here. Yeah. Uh. Ah, you're going after me. Yeah, that's not good. Oh no. Oh hey, I got him. Ah, burst. No, stop running away, you little bastard. Get back over here! Wow, the Barth is going after the Kulu Yaku also. <laughs> I guess he's not done picking a bone with him. There you are. Yeah, the Barth's not done with the fight yet! I don't finish up with a fight or I'll finish it for you! Wow, he's just beating up the... Get over here. Get the hell over here. Thank you for standing still. God damn. Ah! Uh, let's just hope that the Janeth is not going to show up anytime soon. If it does, then that's just going to be a three times the trouble. Because we got three monsters here. One about the size of the Ajanith, a Barath, and uh, the actual Ajanith. What I want is less trouble. What I want is this bird dead. I'm sick of this bird. Get over here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hurt you. Get over here. Get the fuck over here! Stop hurting my partner, goddammit! Oh, sweet, I got his plume. Uh oh. Ow! Ugh. Yeah. Oh God, Barris, what are you doing? You're not the, you're not the monster I was looking for. Yeah. Getting off of you because you're not the target I was looking for. Ah! It's coming this way. Ah, Barris, I didn't mean to. I swear. Screw you. Ah! Okay, the bird's gone. Okay, that makes things a little bit better. No, stop running away, you little bastard! Oh, I know where it's going. It's going to its nest. It's going to its nest to try to heal. I'm not gonna let you do that, you little bastard. Stop it! No! I'm not letting you ha heal, you little bastard! Get over here! Get over here! Just be poisoned and die slowly. Yes, you're poisoned. Ow! Ugh. 
<laughs> yeah, that's right. Be distracted by the pretty diamond. And please don't attack me with a diamond. You're, ta you're thinking about attacking me with a diamond. You're a bastard. You're a bastard! <laughs> Stop trying to do that to me! Thanks for the piercing pod, though. Oh, God! Please don't attack me while I'm healing. Oh, yeah, another piercing pod. I'll get that one another... I'll get that one once I'm actually low on the piercing box. Yeah! Yep! Just accept your death, bird! Damn it. Oh no. Yep! Jump dive! Stop trying to hurt demon blood! God damn! What did Demon Blood ever do to you? Like seriously, I thought you'd be going after me because I just broke I just broke your stupid face and called you a chocobo ripoff, which you are! Oh you you are a little shit. Just tackling me down twice? You are such a little shithead. Get the hell back over here, you little bastard. Thinking you're all high and mighty and shit. No! I know where you're going, you little bastard. Get over here! Oh, let's just hope the Ejanus doesn't think about trying to kill him either. Because trying to fight against both of them, about the same size as they are right now, is going to be a pain in the ass. I just want to take you down, bird! Just take the beat down! Take the beat down! Stop thinking about slamming me down to the dirt. Stop trying to jab the diamond into my skull. Stop it! No! Stop it! Ah, oh, hell no. You're thinking about healing again, you little bastard. Get back over here! You're almost dead! I just want you dead! Crap, he's gonna be getting a lot of health once I get there. Stop healing, bastard! Yeah, screw you too, buddy! No. God damn. Oh shit, that's the Ejanus. You better not think about leaving it, Kulu. Because seriously, you're already being a struggle itself. Stop charging. My god. The fuck. Bastard! Just do me a favor and die. Okay, if I can't capture him, then I'll just try to set up the trap, see if it works. You gotta be kidding. It didn't work? Oh, the diamond! Diamond, why do you have to be such an enemy right now? Ah, oh, goddamn. No! Mm. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. 
I just want to heal. Oh shit, there's the Ajanus. Drop the damn crystal! Nope! Mm, screw you! Drop the fucking crystal, you little bastard! Drop it! Get dunked on! Oh, fucking bird bastard! You were a gigantic pain in the ass! Oh. Well, got the diamond back. Crystal, I don't, I don't know, and I ri right now I don't care. I'm happy I killed this pain in the ass bird. Cause my god. It was a total pain. Uh, I wish I could do a taunt, but I only have uh, like a couple seconds left. You know what? I may have a chance. Uh, where's the gestures? No. Dang it, there goes my chance. Duty complete! And this is just the beginning of the Monster Hunter Final Fantasy special. It took me 23 minutes. I'll guarantee you, it probably did. Huh. It's over. It's dead. Thank God. Now let's go talk to the Moogle. It really has been a long time, and I did not expect Kulu Yaku to be as tough as it is back then. Okay, since we got that done, we'll talk. We'll talk to this lady. Hello, you're back already. Our little Linean friend is safe and sound. Hey. It took my partner forever to find him, though, not being able to see him and all. Which is funny, because he seems to be the only one who can't see our new friend. Even the Seeker can see him. Really? That's weird. Speaking of which, that's literally who's looking after our friend right now. The Keeper? The poor little guy was really shaken up about losing the cr that crystal. He said he's got quite a situation on his hands. Uh, well, yeah... And that's and that he needs our help. Your palco is doing a good job interrupting for interrupting for us so we can figure out what's going on. Oh. So far the only thing we've learned is that his he is a Mughal. Apparently it's some kind of Linean tribe, but not one that I've heard of. Anyway, I came back here to wait for for you while our little friend gets so, some rest. Hopefully he's calmed down a bit. Hey. Come on, let's go pay him a visit. I'm sure he'll be happy to see you. Or he even yet upset because, my god, it took me a while. I even lost to the Yulukaku Kuluyaku once. Wait. Hey there, buddy. Sorry to keep everyone waiting. I brought... I brought our guest of honor with me. Thank you for bringing back my crystal, Koopa. Without this, I'd never be re I'll never be able to return home. I didn't know what to do after that scary-looking chocobo stole my crystal, Koopa. See? C chocobo reference. A chocobo ref off. Um, when you say home, where exactly is that? The home of the Mughals is in er Erezia? This crystal is used 
this crystal, it uses ether to travel to far off lands, Koopo. In a Sorry about that, everyone. My Elgato was being a piece of shit again. So, if... If you're wondering why things just got laggy, it's because of my stupid, uh, stupid Elgato. Or even yet, my stupid computer that is old. So, anyways... In Ar Arzia, utilizing the... Utilizing the ether that runs through the live stream to travel vast distance distance is an important technique. Quite a handy technique if you're in trouble, Koopa. Ather Atheristus are the crystallized ver versions of ether and points at you to the exits. Yeah, points you to the exit of the live stream. Hmm. hmm. This is unlike unlike the technique I have ever heard of. Urza Urzia must be a wonderful land. It certainly is, Koopo. However, recently the ether has become unstable. When I went to see see what the problem was, I got trapped in an odd disturbance. Next thing I knew, I was here, Koopo. And I am not the only one who ended up here, Koopo. I'm afraid an extremely dangerous monster got caught in the disturbance, too. The behemoth. If that monster were to make this land its new home, oh my. Oh dear. our world might be in danger. With the others not being able to see our new f new friend, it'll, it'll be up to us to do something. Life-giving energy that runs through the land. This crystal... And an unexplained invisibility. Instability. I hope I... I don't know. I might just... My words. If I had to hypothesize a monster of Azora or... Organs would only show up in one place in the new world. Right. The Elder's Recess. Of course. So, uh, I've been standing here for a few minutes, and I still can't hear or see this thing you're talking I'm to. Ready. But if you're talking about putting the boom shakalaka, yeah, boom shakalaka on a monster, let's go, let's get a quest together and go. That's what I like to hear, buddy. And I think this is finally the part where we take down, I mean, take on the behemoth. The most threatening and most terrifying beast in Final Fantasy. Though, to be truthfully honest, I think the monster that would have been ten times as threatening and terrifying would be the Behemoth King. If all of you, if all of you remember my Final Fantasy 15 video, you saw the Behemoth King at the front, front door of the kingdom. It's huge, it's got wings, and it is dangerous. But... Me and some other guys were able to take care of it. I'm talking about Gladius, Ignis, and Pronto, and Noctis. Okay, special assignment available. The special beast. I, the legendary beast. Obviously, we know who the legendary beast is going to be since it's been quite a teaser. It's going to be the behemoth. Now, do I have any plans of what I can do about this behemoth? No. What I'm what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do the same thing like I do to every other monsters. I'm gonna fight it and see if I survive. Ooh. Though I feel like my chances of surviving this thing, surviving the behemoth, it's gonna be. <laughs> so that's why we're gonna prepare ourselves and see if we can actually do this and 
And yes, I'm going to keep my uh, poison sword with me because sometimes you never know when poison comes to good use. You just never know. All right, let's just get ourselves some something to eat. And let's get started. Actually, before we do, do I have any like special items that can actually help me increase my stats? I should. Um, let's see. There's these pills. Mega demon drug. I heard that's supposed to be good. Mega armor skin. And mega demon drug. Okay, these two are supposed to help me very nicely since it increases my defense and offense. So I'm definitely going to bring those with me. To be truly honest, I haven't used a lot of items that increase my stat stats. All I do know is I have been using a whole bunch of other items that gets rid of my... Oh. Here it comes. It is the most fearsome beast in Final Fantasy. The Behemoth. I fought my fair share of behemoths on Final Fantasy games, but this is really gonna take a massive level. Let's rock! My god, he's twice the size. And he does pack a punch. So I just gotta be careful of what I do. Behemoths are very dangerous monsters. They know how to kill their opponents very quickly. And they know how to take a punch. As you can see, the damage is, they're not good. Shit! And like I said, they pack a punch. And looks like they got a lot of strong ether inside them. It's casting Meteor. Oh, hey! Haha! -ha! That worked! Oh, it's using wind magic. Like I said, fearsome beast. I'm pretty sure Xeno Jiva would actually do a lot more. I, I'm pretty sure Xeno Jiva would do. I will have a lot of struggles fighting against it. There's the word that I was trying to look for. There's gotta be another diamond around here. There. Mirror Behemoth. Here, buddy. Casting out Fireaga. Oh, no. Now, Aroga. Stay away from Aroga. Otherwise, you're just going to take a massive damage. Ooh. Got some good damage right there.
Okay, it's casting Meteor. That's the magic... Shit. It gave me nine continues. That's how dangerous the behemoth is. Okay, since I died, it's time to boost up. Time to get that armor boost and demon drugs inside my veins. Get myself some food, increase my stamina. And I don't know, and then I don't know if I can actually get a, if I can find a way to get on its back. But I'll tell you one thing for sure. I'm pretty sure that's not going to happen one bit. The behemoth is a very dangerous and powerful beast. Even on Monster Hunter. So it'd be impressive if you were able to beat it in this game of Monster Hunter. Am I a complete idiot? Well, obviously I don't need to say it. Because all of you already know that I am. Already called up a whole bunch of storms. And I don't want to get run into it. Oh, it's using the storm as a shield! That bastard! Kind of wish I could get damaged by its own storm. Oh crap! Shit! Damn it! Still not gonna stop me yet. Obviously, we can't really take down the behemoth. Still doesn't mean that we can actually repel it back. So that's good. Though it would be impressive if I was able to kill it myself. got so many storms around him. I can't really do a whole lot. Sorry, I don't want a taste of your energy, buddy. I know you want me to, but I really don't. Crap. Got hit by it. Son of a... I wish there was a way that I can get rid of those storms. Well... All of you will probably already know that I'm in a failing mission right here. Still not going to stop me. I'm still going to try. No matter what. Just kind of wish I could figure out how to get rid of the storms. But of course, there's not really a whole lot that I can do about that. Okay, I'm going to try to do one more round, and if, and if I can't really beat him, well, obviously, I'm going to need some help. And sadly, I can't find a whole lot. Oh no. Wait, what? 
Yeah, okay. Like I said, I was already in a failing fight. And if all of you are thinking, Oh, you're a complete wuss, you can't beat him solo. Can you? Can you beat the behemoth solo? That's what I thought. Now shut up. But like I said, behemoth is a very powerful and dangerous beast on Final Fantasy and still carries the title of the dangerous beast of all in Monster Excuse me, in Monster Hunter. Am I going to try doing this again? Probably, but once I actually get some help, then I will. So, I hope all of you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to like and subscribe. Share this with your friends and family. Leave a comment below. Join the adventure today. And if you actually want to see me try to hunt some more monsters, which I'm pretty sure there's not a whole lot to hunt down now, but if you do, leave a comment below and I'll probably do it on a, on a live stream. And I'll see you all in the next video. Later, everybody.